What's up, y'all? It's your boy, the Sacktail Pack Hell, back at it with another rip. And today, we have the very, very popular 22-23 Contenders Optic NBA. This has a lot of parallels in it. It has a lot of inserts in it. Has some really nice on-card ink, which I really, really like. Rookie ticket is always a big chase. Those are on-card autos. There's also veteran ticket which are also on-car autos. And there's a couple new inserts this year. You have First Class Ticket and you have Optical Illusion. Those are going to be brand new to the set. Now, the chases in these, there's a few chases which I really, really like. There's the Red Cracked Ice, which is not numbered. The Blue Cracked Ice, which is going to be numbered to 75. The Green Pulsar, which are going to be numbered to 25. Obviously, the Gold Vinyls, one of ones. But they also have the Black Pandora, which are not numbered, but those are very, very short prints. There's also a few other sets in here that they're not considered short prints, but there's not a lot of players in the sets. Veteran Ticket is one of them. There's only 10 players in that set. Also, Sophomore Ticket. There's only 15 players in that set. Gold Rush is another auto set. There's only five players in that. So if you get somebody from Gold Rush, that's a big, big deal. So in these boxes, you're only going to get six cards. There's going to be one auto, two parallels, two inserts, and one base card. Price tag on these, in my opinion, is a little high. $350 off Panini's website. These do resell very, very well. So rookie tickets are very, very highly sought after. They often grade pretty well. So hopefully we get something big. Oh, cross our fingers because I've been on a cold streak. But if you rip enough, eventually you're going to break that streak. So I appreciate you guys tuning in. If you have not already, please don't forget, hit that like, hit that subscribe. We are very slowly creeping our way up. To 20,000. Hopefully, we'll get there. We're at about 16,4, 16,5 right now. So grateful to you guys for that. I was supposed to be up at the Fairfield Card Show right now, which is one of my favorite card shows to go to. However, for those of you that don't know, I do own a couple construction companies and we got some new contracts. And because of that, I was not able to go. So, since I didn't go, I said, let's do some breaks. So here we go. Let's get into this rip. 22-23 Contenders Optic. Let's go. Let's get a banger. I want a big, big rookie ticket here. A black Pandora. A cracked ice would be absolutely out of this world. All right, let's go. Let's start it off. Let's see what we get. This is, I think, the base season ticket. So season ticket is going to be your base card. So if you see a season ticket that is not a parallel, that is your base. Michael Porter Jr., I think he showed out last year. I think he, he showed that he's a very, very nice player in the league. Denver Nuggets still feels weird to call them world champs. Let's see. Season ticket, Sadiq Bay. This is a silver prism, so... Very, very common card. Nothing too big yet. I see a purple right here, though. Let's go. This should be our last parallel. Then we should have some autos. Let's go, baby. Oh, okay. Devin Booker, purple prism. That's going to be numbered to... Uh, oh, that's 15. That's a real low one. 7 out of 15. Didn't realize that was such a short print. But you see what I mean? These are centered very well on this chromium backing. They do a pretty good job on these. A couple years ago, they were not very good, but these seem to be in very, very good shape. Let's see. We got a Maverick right here. Let's go, Luca. Come on, baby. It is not Luca. We got a Mark Aguirre all-time contender silver prism auto. That's pretty nasty. 49 out of 125. Nice auto right there. This is a sticker auto. But I do believe... I, I see a blue cracked ice and a red cracked ice. Woo -hoo -hoo. Let's go, baby. 
Ooh, that's big. This could be a big one right here. Hoop Dreams, Red Cracked Ice. Andrew Nemhard, rookie, Indiana Pacers, Red Cracked Ice. That is nasty. So the Red Cracked Ice are not numbered, but that's still very, very nice. That's one of the chases that you want is to get a Red Cracked Ice. Now that's in one of the inserts, so it's not as big. This is a blue cracked ice, and hopefully it's somebody big. We already got our auto, but the blue cracked ice are going to be the 75. This is one of the chases right here. Let's go, baby. Come on. Okay. Legendary tandems. Tim Duncan and David Robinson. It's a banger. Nice. 30 out of 75. Blue Cracked Ice Legendary Tandems. That is nasty. I'm going to have to look at that under a magnifying glass, but that one to the naked eye right now looks very, very nice. That is definitely going to be getting sent off to PSA. So that's our first pack. Here is our second pack. On this one, I'll try to sweat the auto. For the end, I wasn't sure where they put it in the last one. So I know that it's in the middle now. All right, so first base card. Season ticket is going to be Bam Adebayo. Nice. Miami Sheet, very, very nice. I still am, oh, I see it. Is that a Pandora? Oh my gosh, y'all. We got a Pandora. This is the case hit right here. Okay, now last year I got a case hit Black Pandora and it was a Chris Middleton. Come on, baby. Give me somebody big. I'm on a cold streak. I need it. Let's go, baby. Why does this keep happening to me? I'm so happy to hit a Pandora, but PJ Washington, the only thing you did is knock up the... uh. What's her, what's her name? Brittany, Brittany uh, Renner. Renner. Oh, my God. You're, you're more known for being her baby daddy than you are for basketball, bro. Oh, my gosh. It is what it is. What we got here? We got a purple. Or is this a pink? I'm not sure. Ooh, I'll take that, though. Jalen Green. 38 out of 75. That's nasty. That would have been real nasty last year in his rookie year. There is a print line going across the top. Unfortunately, that really sucks. Now I got to decide if I send this back to Panini or not. Uh, I've got about 15 cards out with them that they still have not sent me back with factory damage. So the next card is our auto. So I'll go from the back. Uniformity, Devin Booker, Silver Prism. I love these cards. Um, I remember when Threads had just the jersey cards very similar to this years ago. I believe it's 2010, 2011. Very, very nice. I like that design, even though it's very, very simple. I like the jersey in the background with the player in the forefront. Very, very nice. See what we got here. Woo! Sweet shots, Jason Tatum, cracked ice. That's nasty. Nice prism right there, red cracked ice. I love these pictures right here. I love how the design is with the other players in the backdrop. With the, they always have really nice action shots of the player. So very, very nice. All right, this is our last card right here. This is going to be our auto. It's going to be a blue. Come on, baby. We need somebody big. Let's go. Perennial Contenders, Bruce Brown. Oh, my God. Ah, nine out of 75. Very nice card. Not the biggest name. Man, this is one of those... One of those rips where it's like, it's hard to be mad because you got some big, big bangers in here, but they were just no names, man. Bruce Brown, Blue Prism, Perennial Contenders, the 75. 
Red Cracked Ice. That's a really nice one. I really like that card. That one's really nice. Uniformity, Devin Booker, Silver Prism, Jalen Green, Pink Prism. Very nice card, but a huge print line. Again, I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but just actually two of them. One's real, real faint under it. Goes all the way across the card. This is one of those cards where... You know, I would probably turn it in to get graded if I thought it was in perfect condition. Um, the corners look very nice, but that print line, I can't. And then this one hurts, man, because this is the chase right here. This is a super short print, and it's P.J. Washington. Out of bio. Now, this one is nice. The blue cracked ice to 75. Legendary tandems. All-time greats. 30 out of 75, Red Cracked Ice, Hoop Dreams, Andrew Nemhard, and then the Mark Aguirre, All-Time Contenders, uh, Otto's a little smudged, but very nice card, Devin Booker, Purple, this one was probably the hit of it all, if maybe that David Robinson and Tim Duncan, but this is 7 out of 15, so the purple is very low numbered. Very slightly off-centered, but other than that, this one looks very nice. Sadiq Bay, Silver Prism, and Michael Porter Jr. So, all in all, not bad. Not bad. Got some really, really... Nice cards that are big chases, just not the biggest names, unfortunately. If that Black Pandora is like, oh my gosh, man, like Apollo or Jalen Williams or one of the big rookies, Benedict Matherin, I'd even love to get Christian Brown. I mean, somebody big, that's a huge card, but unfortunately... <laughs> That is a not a very huge card, but still very happy to pull a Black Pandora because those are very, very hard to hit, and I love those cards. One of my top 10 inserts of any one that we pull, so very happy to pull that. So tell me what you guys thought about this rip. Tell me what you guys thought about this product. I'll give this product probably a 7.5. Uh, price point, in my opinion, even though the cards are very nice, I think the price point's a little high um, because on Panini, they're $350. In your local hobby shop, they're going to be between $375 and $400 uh, for only getting six cards. You know, unless you get just an absolute banger, you're almost guaranteed to lose money on these. But the chases are big. The possibilities are real big. You get a rookie ticket auto. Man, I mean, like I said, Paolo, Jalen Williams, Benedict Matherin, uh, Kessler Walker. There are some big, big names in here that are going to be around for a long time. So there are some big possibilities. If you are able to go out and get some of these, I do recommend that you get a couple because the possibility is definitely worth it. So tell me what you guys thought about this. I really appreciate you guys tuning in. Tell me what you guys want to see me rip next. And until next time, it's your boy, the Sacktown Pack Hound. Be on the lookout for our podcast coming up in the very near future. I appreciate you guys. Let's get it.